I want to tell you guys about a really cool product. It's called the Music Nomad Premium Work Mat and Cradle. Let's check it out. Stay tuned to the end of this video and I'll show you a couple of quick tips when it comes to guitar maintenance. Well, for the longest time, whenever I had to do guitar maintenance, I would sit on the couch and have my guitar on my lap and I would restring it, oil the neck, do any neck adjustments, do any polishing that needed to be done. And I found it to be very annoying because most of the time I'm sitting down trying to keep my guitar from falling off my lap the whole time. And it just, it was really awkward to do uh, in that scenario. So several months ago, I found this product online and I figured I'd give it a try. And over the last several months, I have done many, many string changes and various other forms of guitar maintenance with this mat. And I absolutely love this thing. It's really cool. The mat is made out of a non-slip material that's biodegradable and there's no smell to it at all. There's no rubbery, weird smell to it. Uh, and it basically keeps your guitar from sliding off the table. I mean, look at this. I mean, I have to work really hard to get this thing to move at all. What's cool about that is when you're putting your strings through and you're pulling on them, you can pull on it pretty hard and the guitar is not gonna go flying off the, the table. So, <laughs> I mean, that is really cool and it makes it so much easier uh, to do and the other thing that I like too is this cradle it's got a really unique gel coating on it that's safe for any surface so there won't be any scratches or scuffs at all and there's two heights there's the five inch height and then there's the three and a half inch height the five inch height you would want to use for you know acoustic guitars they have a bigger body so it just makes sense to have a higher cradle to accommodate for that and for other instruments like electric guitars and mandolins and bass guitars, you'll use the three and a half inch height and it'll accommodate those perfectly. It also has a couple of different uh, sizes to cradle the neck in. So for like a six string or a smaller mandolin or something like that, you would use the smaller size. And then for a seven string or bass guitars, you would use the bigger size. Uh, they really thought of everything. And on top of that, they also give you a flat side so you can flip the guitar over and lay the fretboard right across it to do any work on the back of the guitar. So it's like an all-in-one type unit here. It's a one size fits all. All you have to do is turn it, pick your size, and go. And the other really cool thing that I noticed about owning this product is now that it's taken all the stress and the agony away from doing all of my guitar maintenance, I would actually find myself doing extra things now because I wasn't annoyed while I was doing my guitar maintenance. I didn't want to just get it over with. I was more relaxed. I, Like I said, I would just watch TV. I could take my time. I actually found it kind of therapeutic sometimes, you know, to do it. I would actually uh, put lube on the saddles. I would put the nut sauce on the nut here. And I would oil the neck and do uh, the polishing and all that and uh, it was actually really fun. So I, I just gotta say, if you uh, find yourself dreading string changes and guitar maintenance, uh, maybe it's not the maintenance that's bugging you. Maybe it's the fact that you're doing it the hard way and getting something like this is actually gonna make it a lot easier for you. And it's very affordable, it's only $32.99. So if you're looking for a really affordable, uh, no-brainer, type uh, of product to do guitar maintenance with, I found it for you. Another thing that's really cool about this product is it comes with a strap so you can roll it up kind of like a yoga mat and the strap fits around it and it keeps it rolled up and it's portable so you can pack it away and take it with you when you go on tour or just to store somewhere in your house and it doesn't take up hardly any space at all. Click on the link below and get one for yourself. Okay, a couple of quick tips for when you're doing guitar maintenance, especially when you're changing strings. Get yourself a snark tuner. These things are really cool and they're very inexpensive. So this way you can put it right here on your headstock, turn it on, and then when you're restringing your guitar and pulling your strings tight and tuning them, it's right here. You don't have to hook a cable up to anything and look at it out there or do it later 
after you're done stringing your guitar. When I'm stringing my guitars, I actually tune them right here as I'm putting the strings on. And it makes it a lot quicker and a lot easier, and it's hassle-free. Another quick tip. When you're stringing a guitar that has a tremolo system on it, you have springs back there that are very sensitive. And if you pull all the strings off and then put all new strings back on, um, you're going to have a lot of issues with the springs readjusting to the new strings and uh, it's going to go out of tune quite a bit until they finally settle back in. So this is what I suggest. And I know what you're thinking, well how am I going to oil the neck? Well, easy. So what you do is you pull off two strings at a time, oil the section of the neck, and then restring those, tune them, and then pull off the next two and do the same thing until you're done and it actually keeps the springs intact and you'll have a lot less tuning issues when you're done. Okay, I'm going to share one more quick tip with you. If you're restringing a guitar with locking tuners on it, don't make the mistake of doing multiple wraps around the post. What you want to do is pull the string really tight all the way through and then lock the tuner down on it and then snip it and it should only travel around that post maybe a quarter or halfway around it not even a full turn around the post. That way it stays in tune a lot better. And what's nice about this mat is it actually is a, is a non-slip surface. So you can pull on it pretty hard and uh, without worrying about your guitar flying across the table, you still want to stabilize it. But once you got it pulled hard, then just tighten it and then you should be good to go. If you're looking for a really cool product to use while you're doing guitar maintenance, I really can't suggest anything else but this. Music Nomad makes a lot of great products. I'm going to post a link below where you can get one for yourself. Please click on the link and get one for yourself today. $32.99 for all this and you don't have any more stress, no more guitar sitting on your lap, and you're actually going to do a better job maintaining your guitar because you're not going to be so frustrated with the old way of doing it. If you haven't subscribed, please do so and click the bell so that you can be notified anytime I upload a new episode. i got a lot of great episodes coming up and I look forward to sharing them with you soon. Until then, thanks for watching and I'll see you next time.